Welcome back. The Indiana State men's basketball team gave number 11 Wichita State a game tonight. The Sycamores trailed by just one with six to play, but the Shockers were clutched down the stretch and showed everyone in Terre Haute why no program in college hoops has won more road games the last five years than them. Cool moment before the game, ISU freshman Laquarius Page played the national anthem on his piano. On senior night, the two ISU seniors hook up Jake Kitchell, the assist to Justin Gannon throws it down. With less than 30 seconds to go in the first half, Trey Bennett, bullseye on the three. Good guys trailed 28-24 at recess. This game looked like it was going to be over early after the Shockers built a 13-point second half lead. But Christian Smith says, wait a second. He got hot and would rally the Sycamore. Smith had 20. His back-to-back -back threes gets ISU back to within five. Love the heads up play here by Trey Bennett. The Sycamore's guard goes off the defender's back on the out of bounds play. Bennett gathers the ball and hits the teardrop. Later, Bennett would get the steal and he was feeling it. Look at him pull up and nail the three. Sycamore's down 45-39. Darius Carter just tore ISU up. The Shockers big man with the nasty one-handed alley-oop. Carter had 20 points, 11 boards. ISU wouldn't go away. Smith hits the contested jumper. ISU trailed 49-48, six to go. With the game on the line, Shockers point guard Fred Van Vliet shows everyone why he's the reigning MVC player of the year. With the shot clock winding down, the defender all over him. Van Vliet with the dagger. Shockers in the game on a 14-5 run to beat the Sycamores 63-53. ISU falls to 0-5 this year against nationally ranked opponents. Opponents. Sycamore's head coach Greg Lansing didn't get the end result he wanted, but he was proud of his team's effort. We played, we played hard enough to win. Uh, we did. The guys competed. They fought. We wanted to make Wichita leave here knowing that they had to compete hard and play uh, and that we were hard to play against. Now, we did not play well on the offensive end, but you're playing against one of the best defensive teams in the country. Despite the tough loss, Indiana State still celebrated senior night and honored two special Sycamores. The hometown kid Justin Gant was very emotional, as he should be. The former Terre Haute North grad said he loved Terre Haute and always wanted to play in front of family and friends. Jake Kitchell shared his big night with his young daughter, who was a doll and stole the show from her dad. Coach Lansing said you'll never find a better teammate than Kitchell, and Jake said he will always bleed blue. Congrats to both on tremendous careers at ISU.